So this one's similar to number nine when Xiao Ming was making cookies. So you can go back to number nine and look at that one. In this case, we're looking for the remainder, what's left over. So you started doing remainder for division probably in, in um, grammar school, maybe fifth grade, sixth grade, fourth grade, somewhere around there. Now, it's asking you to divide it by nine. So what is the remainder when 599 is divided by nine? So what we're going to do is we're going to set up 599. 599 goes in the house and 9 goes out to the, outside the house. So 599 is divided by 9. 599, 9. So in this case, we're going to need the 9 times tables. So I want to review that one just because I know that that's one that people get stuck on sometimes. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Now it's funny because lots of times when I talk to people about math and they're like, oh, I'm really good at math. And I go to them, I go, what's 7 times 9? And if they can't instantly say 63, then I question them. So hopefully these are all in your head and you don't need to do this, but many people do. And if that's you, don't feel bad because there's lots of people that don't know eight times nine is 72. I think seven times eight is the one that really throws people off for some reason, but that's 56. Anyway, one times nine is nine, two times nine is 18. And again, if you just wanna figure out what the next one is, you take 18, use your fingers and you add nine. So 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. Don't feel bad about using your fingers. Four times nine is 36. 5 times 9 is 45, 6 times 9 is 54, 7 times 9 is 63. And I remember when I was a kid, 6 times 9, I always got that wrong for some reason. I still don't know why. I still kind of pause when I do 6 times 9. Anyway, uh, 7 times 9 is 63, 8 times 9 is 72, and 9 times 9 is 81. Boom. So there's your nine times tables. So what I want to do is obviously five is smaller than nine, so we go to the next one. So 59. So I look down the list and I say, oh, 54, 63 is too big. So I go back to this one. So it's six. Six times nine is 54. Nine, 59 minus 54 is nine. Minus four is five. Okay. And then five... We're done here, so I don't have to worry about that anymore. And then I bring down the nine. So I look at this over here, 59 and up, same number again, six. So 54, because nine times six, nine times six, nine times six is 54. And then I subtract that again. So in this case, we're not going to put out the decimal. We're going to just put the remainder because that's what it's asking for. So it's remainder 5. And then I look over here, letter B. So this is just a review of whether or not you remember how to do remainders. And we did a similar one with problem number nine when Xiao Ming was making cookies.